Hello friends, welcome back to the new tutorial of the Nest.js. Today we are going to learn how to send the Firebase push notifications using the Nest.js. Those who haven't subscribed my channel yet, please do subscribe my channel. And if you like the video, please do like, share and comment on my video. Let's get started. So first of all, you have to globally install the Nest.js CLI if you don't have. Okay, make sure the Node.js version is 20. So I'm working on the 20 Node.js. Now we, have to go in, we are going to create the push notification project. With the help of the nest new push notification this is your project name that is push notifications okay so here i'm going to create the project which package you want to use npm so it will create a next year's project for you okay basic setup you can say this is done moving to the next step that we have we have to install the dependencies that is firebase admin core everything just install this hide this okay mainly you have to install the nest.js platform express firebase admin okay this is done now we have to create the firebase module so let's generate that one nest generate firebase module with the help of this okay now you can see it will create source firebase module.ts okay next we have to generate the firebase service so make sure you have to do this one nest generate okay this is done now in the firebase service.ts you have to put this code okay so let's copy this code and paste it over there okay so let's firebase service.js let's open the code base i think where all the code goes nest.js i think it i'm not in the push notification okay i have installed rest of the things here i'm not in the push notification so cd push notifications okay so in the source we have firebase so let's use this i think let's make it in the nest.js push notification let's do that part okay so let's go and just run this commands over there okay that's not you have to install this one so make sure you have to install okay paste this next we have to go with the generate module firebase generate that one okay then after that we have to set up the firebase service let's add this let's open the code base code okay so code is open with the source firebase okay module and service is there so in the service.ts file you have to add the following code okay so this is our firebase service.ts file so just let's copy this and paste this over there okay so let's paste this so this is done and the send multicast i think which is, which is depreciated we have to use another version that is this depreciated let's check the another version that is send each for multicast so send each for multicast okay just use it word wrap this okay and here we have the push notification service account key file we have we require this one so first of all let's make the full code over there okay so this is done then firebase module.ts just import just add the code over here firebase module.ts okay just add this over there done okay moving to the next use firebase service in a controller okay so we have to generate the controller with the help of the nest generate controller notification okay so let's go and just generate that one and here we go with the source notification controller is there notification notification controller.ts file okay so here we go with the notification then we go with the controllers so here we have a controller file let's paste the code over there okay so here we go with this one so this is for that one multiple notifications i'm teaching you in the next video but for now i'm going to just teach you how to send the push notifications okay this is done okay so now we have to test the notification endpoints okay so first of all let's go to the firebase account so firebase 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 okay so let's open the console over there
okay let's switch the project i think testing i'm going to use it so my push notification web app already there settings in the service account you have to generate the service account file okay i have already i have so i'm going to use it from there okay so i think in the php it is there notification demo file base let me check where it is notification demo i think in js node.js this is the file testing file so i'm going to use that one so let's go to the next js project push notifications here i'm going to paste that part okay so here i need to just take the path of it so firebase service so hey first one so this is injectable logger and admin and the path you have to import okay then logger initialize the firebase admin sdk here you need to add the path so add the path for, for this testing file shift this okay test okay this is our service account file right okay after that admin initialize the app method to send the push notification to the single device which require token title body and the data okay and here i'm going to send the notification with title and the body and the token we have to send okay then admins to send messages successfully sent otherwise it should give me the error part right so this is that one okay moving to the firebase module we have to import that one providers with the firebase service and export that class okay and we have a service file which we have already imported okay and the next one that is notification controller so here we are going to send the push notifications so on the top of it we have a next.js common and the firebase service okay so private read only firebase service so send notification we require body title and the token okay and this we are calling the send push notification function okay so this is that one right in the service it is there okay token title and the body and return that notification sent save this let's go to the postman and try to send the notification and we require the token so we have to launch our previous project that we have already done that is the php notification demo okay so let's open that one so let's open with the browser they have the issues with this script url schema http or https whatever let's open that in the project notification demo in the new vs code and run this project with the go live so now it's working hope so yeah the token is there okay let's copy this token and try to send the push notifications okay so open the new one and here we go with our endpoints notification like this okay so here we go with this one let's make a post request over there and make a body request with raw json and here we have the json file okay so we have to add the token here so let's raw json let's add the device token this is our token let's paste this okay this is test notification let's try to send it oh server is not yet started so npm run start so it's running push notification sent okay let's try to send it up notification true notification sent but i think i'm not able to get the notification let's see 2001 created and it okay error there is error error auth error apns web push service so there is error something in the apns okay maybe the firefox have some i think token issues so let's move to the chrome let's check this one this is working here because sometimes i think my firefox has token issue might be because in my office i have checked and it's working fine so let's check this one okay but it will work both both one okay the code will work both for the firefox and the chrome because i have tested okay so let's try to send it up let me hide this and let's try to send it okay show 
hello no this is a test notification so he's coming right i'm going to make it like this hello technical rajni technical rajni okay so let's try to send it up and hello technical rajni and this is a notification i'm coming up okay so this is how you are able to send the firebase push notification using the nestjs with new firebase http v1 api any doubt any query in that do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video in the coming next videos this would be the extension so where we are going to learn how to send the notification to the multiple devices how to do the call act call action okay when you click on that redirect to somewhere else and uh, the another video that is regarding the there is one more video i guess uh, notification for call of action and the send push notification and topic subscribe to the topic and send the notifications three these three videos are coming so be with me so that you will get all these th four videos in all and without any query do let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day